The Episcopal Refugee Network has become well known for assisting refugees in San Diego County who are unable to access the help they need without our intervention. Many of our clients are referred to us by other refugees or by resettlement agencies and others by members of the community who know of our work. We help individuals or families to develop a plan to solve their immediate problem and also to gain the knowledge and confidence they need to reach for self-reliance. Language is a major barrier, especially in official offices. Even those refugees who speak some English cannot understand what they are being required to do or how to fill in forms without a translator. If they are accompanied by one of our staff or a trusted volunteer, that reduces the anxiety level and provides a safe environment for questions to be asked and misconceptions clarified. Transport is also needed in almost all of the cases we deal with. If they cannot walk there, a large number of refugees cannot get there. They cannot negotiate the many changes of bus route to get to WIC or to dentists and doctors or court appearances, nor do they have enough money to buy bus passes. Even if the family has a car, it is almost always small, and when the major wage earner goes to work, the rest of the family cannot get to appointments. Our donated vans are invaluable, and a driver translator ensures a successful completed appointment. Most refugee families have difficulty putting food on the table in the last week of the month. This often leads to health issues. A parent does not eat, so the children can or so that grandma's medicine can be bought, and then becomes weak or ill. A cutback in work hours or a job loss can make this situation critical. The network outreach workers watch for this and keep an updated list of those in most need of food. They then deliver fresh fruit and vegetables and staples like rice and oil to the adjusted list of recipients. Each family on the list receives auxiliary food twice a month until they are stabilized. Our staff collects and delivers 1,500 pounds of food in our donated truck on four Tuesdays and four Thursdays each month to different enclaves of refugees. Young refugees arrive often with no experience of formal learning and no English. Because many need more help than can be given in school, the network runs four tutoring homework assistance sessions each week during the school year. The high school graduation rate of those who have been helped by the network has been consistently high and students have been excited about being able to understand material that they were not able to keep up with in the classroom. Those who have benefited become a source of information for their parents who also sometimes need our staff to translate for them at parent-teacher meetings. Staff delivering food often are asked to explain bills and other letters that refugees cannot read. They then arrange to take the family to appointments. Children at tutoring sometimes let us know of problems they are having at school or of family members in distress. Each time we are asked to help, we find that there are other issues to be attended to as well. Our staff and large band of volunteers are working with at least 200 families at any given time and touch the lives of at least 4,000 refugees each year. Please check our website, EpiscopalRefugeeNetwork.org, and let us know if you would like to visit with us.